Hi there. It's another cold day out there, and for many of us, it's a case of sunny spells and showers, although for some, showers will be much more likely than for others. And then that combination overnight of cold air and showers will lead to a ice risk in places. The cold air because of an easterly wind at the moment around this area of high pressure. But it's not a true bitterly cold easterly because the ultimate origin for this air is closer to the Mediterranean rather than Siberia. Nevertheless, temperatures lower than average. A chilly feel out there on Monday afternoon. A lot of cloud cover and showers being blown in by that easterly across eastern and southern Scotland, northern England, much of eastern and central England as well. One or two making their way to the southwest, perhaps east Wales, but uh, also one or two showers for northern Ireland, but actually best of any drier and brighter weather towards the west of the UK, best of any sunshine, northwest Scotland, where it is a cold day with temperatures over the upland areas staying below zero and at lower levels three to, well, five degrees generally. Temperatures technically a little higher on that North Sea coast because they're coming in from the sea, but it's not going to feel particularly warm and marked wind chill here. As we head to uh, Monday night then, we're going to see further showers arriving from the North Sea. And as the air cools at lower levels, an increased chance of some wintry hazards. And by that, I mean we'll see some snow falling and settling over the hills of Scotland, as well as northern England. Uh, th above 300 metres or so, some significant accumulations, 5 uh, centimetres and above 400 metres, around 10 centimetres. But at lower levels, we're going to see the air really cooling off overnight uh, and that will lead to possibly some rain showers falling onto frozen surfaces or even falling through freezing air close to the surface and, and that would lead to freezing rain and an ice risk across parts of northeast England in particular, perhaps southern Scotland. So that's something that is worth uh, stressing there in the forecast. Uh, some slippery surfaces in places by the time we get to Tuesday morning. Additionally, further showers streaming in from the North Sea for Kent and some very wet weather at lower levels here to come during the next couple of days but even some snowfall accumulating over the North Downs by the start of Tuesday. Tuesday starts cold for many of us, temperatures below freezing. These are generally the temperatures for uh, coastal and urban areas. So inland and in rural locations, we can expect even lower temperatures and perhaps as low as minus 10 Celsius in rural northwest Scotland. Otherwise, uh, it's a bright start for the day in the west and a lot of cloud cover further east and further showers coming in with, again, snow of the hills of northern England, southern Scotland, perhaps the North Downs. And, Showers falling as rain or sleet, generally at lower levels. A similar day then to come on Tuesday compared to Monday. And a similar feel with that easterly breeze bringing a marked wind chill to the east in particular, four or five Celsius there, three or four elsewhere. But uh, pleasant enough given the dry and bright weather further west if you're out of the wind, a crisp winter's day. So that ice risk tonight, especially for northern and eastern parts of the UK, and uh, we'll keep you updated. Follow us on social media for those updates or head to the Met Office website and app. Bye-bye.